Hello kids from Church Central South, etc. My name is Rich and it's good to see you, or rather be watched by you on a screen. I'm guessing a phone, but maybe a TV, possibly a tablet, maybe a computer, maybe the side of a building in the middle of town. Who knows where you're watching this. This is a little video for you, the kids of Church Central, because, oh, sad, we can't meet all together at the moment, which is really sad. However, we are still the church, and we do still love Jesus, and he still loves us, and he still wants you to have lots of fun as you learn about him. And so a few friends that you'll recognize from church are putting together some videos over the coming weeks to help you Think about Jesus and have some fun, even though we're not all meeting together at the moment. In this video, you're gonna get to play a little game, sing a little song, and learn about something that Jesus says, which I think isn't true. I think it's a lie, and you're gonna have to help me because we can't be accusing Jesus of lying because that's a bit mean, but that's what I think, because here's what Jesus said, see what you think of it. He said, the church, the boys and girls and men and women of the church are two things. He said they are salt and they are light. I'm telling you guys, this is a lie. I am not salt, I am human most of the time. And I am not light, I am something that light bounces off, especially that bit of my head because it's losing its hair, that bit just there. And so I'm not light. So is Jesus lying? Well, we're going to have a little think about that and you're going to help me with it just at the end of this video. But first, we're going to play a little game. Are you ready for the game? The game is called Salt or Sugar. Salt or Sugar. And what's going to happen is I am going to put some salt and some sugar in these pots. There is the salt. There is the sugar. It's going to go in there and it's going to look similar and so you're not going to know which is which. And here's the fun thing, I'm going to mix them up so I don't know which is which. And then I'm going to lick my finger, dip my finger in one of them and then lick either sugar or salt. And before that you're going to get to guess which is it on this go. Is it salt or is it sugar? Let the games begin. Okay my friends, I have some sugar and some salt, or is it some salt and some sugar? And I don't know which is which, but I'm gonna put them there and I'm gonna lick my finger and I'm gonna dip it in and you have to guess, am I gonna be really happy because it's sugar or a little bit because it's salt? Guess, am I gonna be taking sugar or salt? Guess, nice and loud, three, two, one, salt! Oh, nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> so much of it. Oh. <coughs> okay. Oh, it's still there. <coughs> okay, I'm back and I'm feeling so much remorse about this. Okay, remorse means like regret. Ask a grown up. Okay, um, we're gonna do it again. We're gonna mix them up. Sugar or salt? Sugar or salt? Here we go. Wait, put them in camera. Okay, is it gonna be sugar or is it gonna be salt? Have a guess, nice and loud. Three, two, one. Sugar. Oh, let's have another dip. Oh, that resolves the problem from earlier. My neck feels alive again. That is a lot better. Let's do one more go. Let's mix it up. And this time, make it really difficult. I'm going to shut my eyes. So I really don't know which is which. Can you see it? Let me check if it's in the camera. It is. Okay. I'm going to dip into this one. Okay. Is it salt or is it sugar? Three, two, one. Salt! No! Ah! <laughs> oh! Ah, ah, I have now recovered, thank you for asking, and now there's going to be a song and Dan and Beth have recorded this and they're going to put some actions in. If you want to join in, you can, so get up on your feet and get energetic or if you want to just this week, just watch it, you're feeling a bit more like that, 
that's fine. And maybe in future weeks you can do it. But I reckon you should at least make your grown up do it. Okay, over to them. Hi everyone, happy Sunday. It's Dan and Beth here and we're gonna be leading you in a song all about God's goodness. Um, we're gonna take you through the chorus first and show you the actions for that bit so you're all ready to go when we get there. And then we'll sing the whole song. There are some actions for the verses as well, but you can just follow me along for those ones. Um, but yeah, let's get going. And I'll sing because you are good And I'll dance because you are good And I shout because you are good You are good to me, to me Perfect, well done. The only thing to say is when we get to that bit where it says I'll shout because you are good Just like Dan, you've got to make sure you shout really, really loudly to show God how good he is Let's go for the rest of the song then I want to scream it out from every mountain top. Your goodness knows no bounds. Your goodness never stops. Your mercy follows me. Your kindness fills my life. singing or watching or fast forwarding we are nearly done i reckon but i really like it if you could help me with something before we go because i'm still confused about this thing that jesus said that's clearly not true and he said that we're salt which we're not and light which we're not except maybe it is true maybe jesus means that we as the church are like salt that would make more sense and maybe he means that we are like light. What I want you to do is just with whoever you're with, I want you to see if you can work this out for me. 
It's a bit of a puzzle and a bit of a problem, but see if you can understand what does he mean? In what ways are we to be like salt? And in what ways are we to be like light? I'm not gonna give you the answers because I basically don't know them, but I want you to have a little think. Salt and light, what's Jesus talking about? See if you can come up with one, two, three, that's three, reasons why Jesus calls us salt and light. That's it, we love you, we'll see you soon, bye.